Hello. Um, I am Pepper Cat. You know me, all of you, if you're here. And if you don't know me, know me. Okay. All right, say. Um. Anyway, y'all, guess what? As it may be obvious from my current surroundings, I have a computer now. Yay! I got it for my birthday, which was yesterday. And today's my dad's birthday. So, yeah. Um. So I thought it would be fun to record myself, me playing clan gen. And I wish it recorded me picking the cats, but I thought I was recording, but I wasn't. But oh, let's see. But if you don't know, clan gen. It's a popular game that was going around. It was a huge trend last year and for some of this year. It's still around and lots of people still play it and it's still getting updated, but it doesn't have the same mega blast that it had before. Like, it was literally everywhere. It still is everywhere, but you know what I mean. Um, so yeah, I'm late to this trend. Like, always I'm late to literally every trend in the world. Um, that is fine i think so these are our cats we have three cats zinnia paw bin paw and shadow paw these cats have been chosen because by star clan because there was a very deadly 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 plague that wiped out all the rest of their cats clan cats so a bit of backstory is these cats um were in a prophecy and the leader was like oh no we gotta kick them out because they're weirdos and then they were like okay but they brought their mentors of course needle star well needle whatever their name was before um i don't remember <laughs> Um, Needle Star, Thunderleg, and Flight Chase, and their friend Alderpaw. And they were brought to this clan, Moth Clan. And, yeah, if you hear background noises, it's just my family. And I'm sorry about my mic quality. I don't even have a mic, so that's why it's so bad. Um, but anyway. And I will change my background eventually to like a moth or something. Because, let's be honest, what is this? Why are their faces deformed? Like, it's kind of nice, but like, I ain't gonna have it forever. So, these are cats. They're chosen ones. So, this is Zinnia Paw. Ask Finn Paw if they're ready to be a warrior. They're, they're female, adolescent. She has copper eyes, very beautiful. Two color pelt, medium fur length, is eight moons. An apprentice, adventurous, all the observant, trainee, and clan founder. Oh, what is this? Huh? Okay, uh, we have to click it. What? Wait, what is this? Is it like... You can see them when they were younger! <gasps> oh my god! Wait, I need to see all my cats as children. They're so cute! Oh my god. <laughs> okay, sorry. I'm sorry about that. Um, anyway. <clears throat> Uh, let's check their relationships. Okay. They hate Shadow Paw. Well, not hate, but dislike. Um, and they respect Finn Paw. That's good. We always want to respect our children. Also, there is a reason why I chose these three cats. So, they each represent one of my friends in my friend group. So, Shadow Paw is me. Finpaw is my friend who's actually, um, I nickname her Finn, 
I'm not gonna say her real name because <laughs> the stalkers. <laughs> um, but I call her Finn all the time. So Finn Paw, I had to choose them. And then Zinnia Paw is gonna represent my other friend. I'm not gonna say the name of because I don't have a nickname for them. But yeah, so Shadow Paw is me, Finn Paw is Finn, and Zinnia Paw is my other friend. So for safety reasons, I'm not gonna put their names. I already sent out Shadow Paw on one patrol, and that's why they're not here right now. Because I thought I was recording, but I wasn't. <laughs> but I still know nothing about these cats, and there it hasn't even been a moon. So don't worry about it. You didn't miss anything. Finpaw was recently caught humming to themselves. Yes, I love Finpaw. They're so cute. Mm. Uh, they're female, adolescent, eyes pale yellow, two color pelt, fur length is medium. They're six moons. An apprentice, nervous. Oh. That is so cute. Splashes in puddles. And confident with words. They're untrained and they're a clan founder. Let's check their relations. Okay, so they're pretty good friends with everyone. But they like Shadow Paw best. And Shadow Paw does not like them the best. They like Zinnia Paw, but Zinnia Paw hates them. Mm, they're jealous. Ooh. Jealous. Maybe because she's prettier. <laughs> Zinnia Paw, I'm sorry, you're very beautiful, but I'm not a sucker for orange and white cats. I mean, I love orange cats, but I love tortoiseshell calico. Even though she's rosette, it gives tortoiseshell vibes, so that's one of the main reasons I picked her. <laughs> okay, anyway. Um, they're untrained, and a clown found their six moons, of course, of course. Um, baby, <laughs> little baby must go back. Um, little baby must go back. Little baby, okay, I'm sorry. <laughs> but they're so cute. <laughs> they're dying. Okay, anyway. Shadowpaw has been training very hard with What do you mean? You, you're, you are fresh, a fresh sacrifice, fresh blood, fresh meat. You're six seconds old. How are you already training? Girl, don't put so much stress in. In grade five, I, no effort. Okay, no effort. No effort. I was just chilling with my frenzies. So, just chill, okay? Especially on the first few days, it's all about making the new friends. So, I'm just saying grade 5, because grade 5 was my favorite year ever. I loved grade 5 so much. My teacher was beautiful and amazing. But anyways, no one cares. So, let's get on to patrols. So, Finpaw. We're going to put you out by yourself. And since you are fresh blood, we're going to send you out on a border patrol. So you can explore the territory. <gasps> Already? Finpaw finds an abandoned kit whose parents are nowhere to be found. Mm, I don't know. Mm. Okay, normally people would instantly accept it, but I want to get to know the cats better before getting to know another one. Let's proceed. Oh, okay, little kit. We have a child that I didn't want. Okay. Oh, the other reason is because I love having small clans, because then I can get attached to the cats, and then I can have a bigger clan when I'm more attached to them. But, so that's why if we find any more Vanna kits or anything like that, we're just going to leave them be. So Zinnia Paw, you want to become a warrior, so let's have you go on a hunting assessment. Zinnia Paw decides to hunt out near the two legs. Carelessly, Zinnia Paw is seen by two legs and is taken. No! No! Zinnia Paw, come back! I didn't mean it. You lost. Okay. I have had cats that have come back, though. They're being lost, so. I guess I can focus on these guys for now. Oh, that's so morbid. Okay, anyway. Time skip. Birth and death. The past moon. Oh, these are just about. 
little kid. You don't even know them. Okay. We're not gonna pay attention to that. Because... Um, that is not important. This is about the other cats dying. Finpaw, just notice how beautiful- uh, girl, no. <laughs> how beautiful Shadowpaw's eyes are. Ooh. Okay, Shadowpaw's been sending time. It's been probably Ooh, okay. Little Paw su is surprises Shadow Paw with something nice. <gasps> That's cute. Little li li Wait, did I say Little Paw? The little kid. Little kid. That's so cute. Wait, why are you in the med den? Shock. Oh, yeah. Right. From some randos you didn't even know. <gasps> oh, my God. Wait, Finn Paw is on top of the rock, and I, I kind of love it right now. Oh, <laughs> That's so cute. Okay, we're gonna check your relations because you're spending time with each other. So, time to check your relationships. Oh, your life improved. That's good. It has been one moon. <laughs> Girl. Okay, well, they're better friends now. We're gonna show the dead people. Oh, God. No, we're not. Show empty, yes. Okay, well, anyway. Um. Oh, Finpaw, oh my god. Fell into a nearby creek yesterday and is still feeling damp. Finpaw, no. Don't do that, baby. No, stop it. Shadowpaw had quite the adventure today. Hmm, good for you, my little child. Sorry. Okay, I'm gonna go on a patrol now. Meditating and environment environment that changed. Um, okay. Shadow Pot catches the son of a fox, but is it red or gray? Checking it, they find um their red enemy feeding on a deer fawn carcass. It's impossible to say whether the fox killed it or found it. Okay, what am I gonna do? Mediating, advising, strict. I don't think we're gonna do this one. No, we're not gonna do it. I don't think she would. I think if the fox and the deer were in the fight, she'd be like the one pygmy girl that's like, everyone calm down. <laughs> okay, well, anyway. Uh, Shadow Power just uh, it's getting a quarrel with the fox. Smart. Don't do it. Bestie. I don't want another dead kitty cat. Well, she's not dead. She's just lost. Okay. Finn Paw encounters a porcupine bristling with kills. We love the kills. Uh, quills. Okay, I love the art, but this one is a bit goofy. <laughs> but trust me, I could not draw a porcupine any better. Boop! <laughs> okay. Finpaw encounters a porcupine bristling with quills. Oh, let's do it. Um, the porcupine whips around, digging the quills of its tail into Finpaw. Uh oh. Finpaw returns to the cow with a dose full of clothes and a wounded friend. Finpaw, oh, I shouldn't have done that because the was nervous. I forgot to check it. I don't think she would have done it. I'm sorry. <laughs> okay, um, you're in the medicine cat den. How bad is it? I know. Okay, everyone's sick. That's great. And we don't have a med cat. So it's going to take like five years for them to all to get have quite the adventure today. We already saw that. Uh, asking older little kid. I don't think you want to know. I don't think you want to know. Okay, so here goes another man. That was so fast. Okay. Bro. Okay, there we go. Ceremonies. <gasps> Interested in herbs. Even in their kit kithood. Little Paw is eager to be made the new medicine cat apprentice and learn how to heal from those who came before them. Helps. Little Paw is distraught to find the infection <gasps> has set on their quill wounds. Finpaw, not Little Paw. Little Kit finally feels more than, like themselves. The shock is gone. 
relationships. Good Paw wants to spend more time with Shadow Paw. That's cute. They could be besties. Shadow Paw appreciates a Finn Paw telling them that they had a feather stuck to their face. Little Paw called Finn Paw the wrong name. I mean, with being. Yeah. Uh, you. Yeah. We've all done it before, let's be honest. Like, don't lie. You've done it. You've called your bestie the wrong name. Or your teacher. You. Everyone has at least once called their teacher mom. Porcupine. Oh, God. Finn Paw. Okay, Little Paw, you're going out on patrol right now. I don't care if it's the middle of the night. You need to find herbs. The plantain plants have reawoken. And Little Paw plans to gather some of their leaves. Oh, sure. Deep green. Even in Nulu. N Nulu. Nulu. Yeah. Even in Nulu. With a characteristic smoothness, Little Paw finds the plantain where they expected, right in the middle of our path. Sorry, I'm speaking with you, so I'm like, don't judge. Okay, well, you chose to live. Looks good. Your hair. <laughs> okay, anyway. Uh, let's check our stats and our relationships. Has been training very hard recently. Yep. You gotta heal your clan, Dusty. It's pressure on you. So. Is looking forward to today. Good. Okay, that's good. Is participating in rather training session. Uh, yeah, sure. <laughs> okay. Um. Um. Okay. <laughs> it's your relationship. Okay. Oh. Um, I don't think a bloodthirsty med cat is really what we want. But okay, um, they like Finn Paw. They like Finn Paw. <gasps> Finn Paw loves Shadow Paw. That's cute. I love that. Still have a bit of a crush. You like Finn Paw, but you like Zinnia better still. Even though Zinnia is a. <laughs> Zinnia hates you. I'm sorry to break it to you. How is missing your mentor's guidance? You don't have a mentor. What do you mean? How you doing? You still hate Shadow Paw. How are you doing? You're almost a warrior, actually. Well, ready to be one. It doesn't mean you are going to be one, but anyway. Shadow Paw, apprentice strict. Meditating and advising training. So I say we go up to five minutes. How long is this been going on? Um, I'm not quite sure. Eighteen minutes. Okay. Yeah. So we're probably gonna stop. It's probably gonna be about like twenty-five minutes. Uh, we're gonna stop at five minutes. Maybe even twenty minutes. But yeah, it, we're gonna go to five moons. Um, yeah, maybe when our clan gets a bit bigger, we can fit in. We can squeeze in some more moons. Shadow paw, you are going to go on a hunting patrol, bringing back food for everyone because that's your job now. If you don't get food, everyone's gonna die. No pressure. A shadow paw tears through the forest. Stretching their legs on a run. They spot a movement out of the corner of your eye. You're gonna do it. You gotta feed your clan. Shadowpaw skids to a halt and tries to sprint after it, but the bird they saw escapes their paws. They chatter angry at, angrily at it. It tries to <laughs> and it tries to poop on them. Such is life. Oh my god. <laughs> it tries to poop on them. Shadowpaw. Don't make the birds hate you too. Zinnia already hates you. Don't make the birds hate you as well. Okay, birds and dust. <gasps> Shadow paw and little paw are the only cats in the clan now. No. Finn, if you're watching this, you died. I'm very sorry. But you did. Bestie. It was too early. That was way too early. 
the past women have been caused taking their place on Star Clan. Moss Clan more mourns their loss. And their clanmates will miss the spot they took up in their lives. Moments of the life moments of their life are shared in stories around the circle of mourners. As those who were closest to them take them to their final resting place. That would be both of you guys. You both love them. No, Zidia Pa. You must be so sad because they were like your friends. When you come back, you won't have any friends. Except for Zidia Pa. Let's hope that you do. I'm going to hope that you make friends with Zidia Pa. Um, Shadow Pa, you need to catch me for everyone. <laughs> Shadowpaw heads out into the forest alone, wanting to sink their teeth into some prey that they're... Okay, I know you haven't eaten in, like, two days, but you've got to save some for Little Paw. They don't even know how to hunt, okay? Let's see. Shadowpaw turns back to camp, deciding that a group hunt would be more effective. Oh! It just thundered where I'm right now. I'll be right back. I'm gonna go see if that's... I think it is raining, yay. Yeah. I'll be able to fall asleep. The sound of rain, that's great. Um, Shadowpaw turns back to camp, descending that a group hunt would be- No! You still have to catch the food, just don't eat it, okay? Little paw, bloodthirsty, you scare me. Anyway. Oh, yep, it's definitely raining now. <laughs> More marigold would be useful, particularly with green leaf and false wind. The season will bring the marigold to broom, to broom, um, and the flowers are just as useful as the leaves to Little Paw, and extremely easy to spot from a distance. Okay, Little Paw is distracted today, and it affects their work. The patrols on some- Y'all are- Okay, well, it makes sense you'd be distracted. Your friend just died. Feels disappointed after a miscatch. After you, that bird tried to poop on you? Doesn't understand the point of keeping sickly old elders healthy with per Bro! No. Little Paw, you're already bloodthirsty. Don't disrespect the elders. I'm hating you more and more every second. Like, come on, guy. Like, guys. Like, stop. Okay. Um. That was really depressing. Let's check their relationships. Shadow Paw is really surprised that Little Paw's life isn't as easy as they thought it was. Yeah, duh. Little Paw had a fight with Shadow Paw. Okay. Pinpaw died. No, I'm so sad that Pinpaw died. Okay, anyway. Time skip. Um, Little Paw. Uh, Shadow Paw had an argument with Little Paw. Little Paw shares a joke about a neighboring clan with Shadow Paw. Little Paw got heat exhaustion. No! Makna does not have enough healthy medicine cats. We'll be sick. Okay, we need to get some people back here. Shadow Paw, go find some new recruits. Small dog. All Shadow Paw's attempts to drive the small dog off only to send it into greater and greater fits of excitement until the only thing to do is wait miserably and humiliatingly in a safe spot until the beast calms down. Okay, that sucks. How? Why? What's going on? Oh, you have heat stroke. Um, I mean, nothing I can do about that. You're chattering in the birds. No, go to sleep. Go to sleep. Or go in some water. Busy chattering fellow apprentices, but no one is sure what for. Okay. Um, you hate Chapa. You. Oh, Zinnia Paw has to those thing now. Um, you also hate Little Paw. No, the only two cats left hate each other. That's really sad. What time are we at? Um, only 24. Okay, yep, one more thing. Um, Moss Clan does not have enough healthy medicine cats. It's not good. That is not good. Okay, Little Paw catches. Shadow Paw catches Little Paw staring at another cat. What other cat? Little Paw brings Shadow Paw some fresh kill, hoping that they remember what Shadow Paw's favorite is. <gasps> yes, become friends again. 
Little pots can be custom hairs updated. Good. Good. Okay. Let's check. Oh. Uh. Um. Uh huh. Okay. It's not concerning at all. Um, little pal, you know that's illegal, right? You're a medicine cat, but we're not gonna stop that from happening because we need children in this clan. The heat of green leaf brings warmth to their pelt as little pal wanders aimlessly, searching for daisies to harvest their leaves. Daisies may seem like a part of the everyday carpet greenery present everywhere from rocks to fields to nestled at the foot of trees, but that doesn't make their leaves any less useful. Daisy was gathered. Okay, that's good. Shadowpaw, apprentice. Oh. <gasps> Oh my god, it's been so hot recently, but with the clouds provising a slight drizzle, Shadowpaw has the zoomies. Their mentor suggests with a weird amount of humor that they should go hunting if they're so energetic. Sure, yeah, do it. Shadowpaw is thrilled to find a nice stoat. Even more thrilled to catch the second one. Yes, you guys can eat food now. You won't have to die. Let's go. Okay, let's check up on how you guys are doing. Memorizing the names of all the herbs. Eating fresh kill. Zinnia is still lost. These two have crushes on each other. Um, We're going to see what that leads to. But for now, I think that's where I'm going to end this episode because it's pretty long. So, yeah. Um, I will see you guys in the next episode of Moth Clan. So, I just want to say real quick, bye.